This bird is really, really unique in the way that it flies, in the way that it forages. You'll see that when it's flying along a shoreline, it's actually dragging its lower bill along the edge of the water. As soon as it hits a fish, it quickly snaps shut and consumes the fish. The other thing you'll notice when the bird's feeding along the shoreline is that its wings, instead of flapping just outward, its wings are tucked back. And that's so that it can skim along the surface of the water and not get hit by waves. Their numbers have been in decline over the last probably 40 years. They've gone from 10,000 plus nesting pairs on the coast down to around 3,000 nesting pairs on the coast. Let's try from this side. Today we're in the Laguna Madre, uh, a stronghold of black skimmers. Birds everywhere. And this is sort of part of a continuing series of studies we've been doing to try to better understand uh, the species itself, species biology, but also why it's declining. Without adding young birds, new birds coming into the population, the population is just going to continue to decline. Um, we want to make sure that we provide every bit of protection that we can for the birds so that they can hopefully nest successfully, raise young. It's on solar and it's uh, recharging a couple of AA batteries to keep it running so we don't have to disturb the colony too often to check these out. That's taking a photo every minute. If the birds get up for any reason, uh, then hopefully we can understand what it was that got the birds up uh, from that camera. Some of these islands are getting disturbed 20, 30 times a day, and the average time that the colony is off the nest during a human disturbance is typically about eight minutes. That's very, very, uh, very long time, especially in the heat of the summer in Texas. So this is one of the big threats to birds is people fishing just uh, too close, wanting to get a little bit too close to islands. I'm a big fishing tournament right now. Appreciate you giving me some room. Oh. oh. So this guy's fishing a tournament, and um, even though this guy's too close to the island, he feels that his uh, need and right to fish too close to the island is, uh, is more important than uh, the bird, giving the birds a safe place to nest. There's quite a few pairs here. Looks like several have got scrapes. So they've, they've got a lot of challenges they have to overcome. So to see an area like this where We've got you know, pretty high elevation. They're back away from the beach, so hopefully human disturbance won't be a big deal. Uh, so this one has a pretty good chance. 